Well, hello and welcome, movie lovers of the world. I'm Brandon, and this is my movie review show. Got a huge one today, Avatar 2, The Way of Water. Joining me today is my co-host, Alex. Hey, Brandon. Hey, man. Really excited to talk to you today about Avatar at Camino de Agua. So let's get going. The film marks James Cameron's return to the silver screen in years, having not directed a feature on length film. Um, hey, Brandon. You forgot to introduce me. Oh, my bad, Lewis. Didn't think you were on today. I mean, I'm, I'm on every day. So. Really? I haven't noticed. Anyway, uh, with us today is series guest star, Lewis. Hey, Lewis, thanks for making the time. I know you're really busy. No problem. Yep. Wasn't planning on making dinner for three, if you know what I mean, but I'll figure it out. Anyway, when you look back on James Cameron's illustrious career, several classics come to mind. I mean, this guy basically defined the modern blockbuster with films like Blade Runner, Transformers, Demolition Man, Over the Top. The list goes on. I mean, speaking for myself, I always looked at Jim Cameron as the father that I never had. It's just Pocahontas, they say. It's just a dance It's cute. Transformers, Jaws, Demolition Man. Lewis, Lewis, what's up? Huh? Is everything all right, man? You're being like super cringe right now. Yeah, everything's fine, Brandon. I'm good. Okay. Well, anyway, back to my point about how the Navi actually symbolized the online incel community, right? So when you're thinking about these things...